here, and usually how I'm going to use my, my, bat, my butt spike is I'm going to thrust up, and then I'm going to get somebody to come in. Oh, yeah, yeah. So they draw me up like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wheel it up, and then I'm going to use, I'm going to, I'm going to lift my arm up on this side, and then I'm going to use this side as the pull cue. So before, I was sliding in this hand, push, and I'm going to have my hand up like this, and then I'm going to pull cue here. So now I see a lot of guys go like, as soon as they push up like this, they try to just kind of bring it in like this. And there's nothing wrong with that, but but if I'm standing here, what do I want to get in like this? Or would I rather stand here and go like this? You know, I'd rather like reef on him and give myself the range than, than actually step in. But like a lot of people will do it like, they do it very impulsively. They're here, and then they whip this around, and they almost do like a punch something but but yeah you don't want to punch somebody in the head like that obviously but if you're here you can just crank it in I like that a lot better it seems to work pretty good it's a little bit harder to do I mean you can still do it with that one correct right? yeah excellent okay but you do you have to have a little bit of half to work with so it is harder to do with that you're obviously not going to butt spike with a two-handed or a, yeah Okay, um, so let's uh, talk about like, uh, I'm just kind of whipping through there, but then we'll, we'll like stand in line and we'll do the shots. Um, the other one was the oar stroke, and uh, I also, that's a down one as well, where you, you basically disengage like this, and then you roll it back over. So I'm here, I thrust, you strike, and then I just crank it over the top. But you're gonna roll it to here, so you're not going to do the full rotation, you just roll it to here, and then crack it. Now, you can, you can just do the rotation, or you can do, as you push in, you can roll, and then I can extend it as well. So I can keep moving back as he engages. I can step away and throw it. So it ends up coming in more like a two-handed sword, but... Uh, but it's very fast. Now, I know that that's a, you know, most of the time, your, your guys, your tendency, and a lot of people's tendency will do it to be like, as soon as you strike, to be up like this, and blocking. Um, and there's nothing wrong, I mean, I, I haven't really gone over just a straight, straight slot shot down the middle. There's no reason that you can do that, too. But I, I didn't, there's not as many body mechanics in that. So, coming here, striking, throwing, coming back, somebody knocks you up, or they come in to, to bind you, and then you come up, and then just come straight down. But, but I mean, that's, I think that comes to people pretty naturally. There's not as many body mechanics. And, uh, um, you know, since, since we're really not talking about, uh, I mean, the Moline, and the, uh, the oar stroke are really ones that I like to use when they're retreating. So, so if, if you're pressing for me, I really want to roll the one, or I really want to, I want to be moving away with you. I want to be fading into me as I, as I take the shot. Um, I can do that off the wall. You can come up and do a clench like this, and I can push you off. And then chop, but still, I'm taking a step back from you. I mean, it's, if I can get you to move away from me, then I can take the shot forward. But the mechanics, for me, I think they work a lot better as a fading. And uh, I, I think that people, if they're, if they're fighting two poles together, they're either going to be trying to stay at range or they're going to be jumping like right on top of your head. They did, generally, you're not going to stand here for very long. It's going to be like this, throw, or it's going to be like rushing in on you. There's, there's not going to be a lot of that middle ground. Um, so, you want to you want to pair up and just do, why don't we do that? We'll pair up and then just try Moline on each other. Pair up with somebody. Bar.
Well, I don't think Davin really wants to do it because his knee is bad. 